Good day everyone. Do you want to learn about something? Well, for today's video, I'm going to share to you what is information and communication technology and together with the types and what is the role of information and communication technology in teaching and learning process. Did you know that ICT stands for Information and Communication Technology? Well, ICT also refers to the use of computing and telecommunication technologies, systems, and tools to facilitate the creation, collection, processing, transmission, and storage of information. In fact, the ICT is a broad subject and the concepts are evolving. The types of ICT or Information and Communication Technology includes hardware, wherein it involves computers, servers, routers, scanners, not ever tools, wherein it helps to store, retrieve, manipulate, transmit, or receive information electronically. And the next type is software, wherein it includes operating systems, applications, and programs that enable users to perform specific tasks like word processing, spreadsheet management, and graphic design. So the next type of ICT is the network, wherein it involves local area networks and wide area networks that help to uh, exchange of data and communication between devices. So what do you think is the role of ICT in teaching and learning process? Well, appropriate use of ICT can transform the entire teaching and learning process. The in integration of ICT in education has had a significant impact on educational quality. It is often considered that integration of ICT will assist us in making education more accessible and e inexpensive. So, like for example, the word Excel, Access, PowerPoint, Animation, and Graphics can also be used to enhance content learning. So in fact that through ICT it helps us to access the information or enhance learning experience or even the collaborative learning wherein it, there is an interaction between teachers and learners and it also helps us to prepare for the future. Especially as a teacher, we need to meet the needs of the 21st century learners or in fact that through ICT it helps to transform the teaching and learning process by making it more interactive, engaging, and effective. So those are the things related to information and communication technology. And I hope that you learn a lot of things about the crucial role of ICT in our society today. Thank you for watching.